outside there. Twin Oaks 11 to 8, 11 to 2, Wilsford. And racing towards the first. Boreen Owen right up there with Twin Oaks also. Seagram over on the far side. Party Politics solid as a rock with his white face over on the far side, not far off the front. And uh, mistakes they have by Twin Oaks. Made quite a mistake at that one. Party Politics gone to the front now. Kildimo right up there, which is very unusual in the early stages towards the left of the picture. Solid as a rock over on the far side with Seagram. All safely over there. No, they're not. Seagram is down. Seagram is a faller at that one. Nigel Hawke sitting up. Now uh, gets to his feet and Seagram's all right too and as they come to the first of the ditches Party Politics jumped it very big and clean in the lead from on the near side Kildimo who just takes a fractional lead now over on the far side is solid as a rock and then Twin Oaks and behind them come over the twist and on the far side is Wilsford then Cool Ground and behind Cool Ground is uh, Withy Bank and David Stukey is the back marker and one from last is Boreen Owen and they're over on the far side now with the one who's departed, Seagram, of all horses. Kildimo, the leader, from Solid as a Rock and Party Politics and Withy Bank on the inside of Twin Oaks and then Wilsford. Then on the twist and cool ground on the near side, Boreen Owen and finally David Stukey as they come to the next. Kildimo in the lead from Solid as a Rock and Twin Oaks, the big Twin Oaks who goes up on the outside, but once again jumps it just a little bit stickily, Twin Oaks. And it's Kildimo from Solid as a Rock and Party Politics and Twin Oaks and on the twist on the outside. Then Withy Banker behind them, Cool Ground and Wilsford. And they're all safely over that. Maureen Owen jumped it next to last and last was David's Dukey. Kildimo and Party Politics from Solid as a Rock and Twin Oaks. Withy Bank on the twist, cool ground. Another plain one now before the next ditch. And Kildimo jumps it in the lead from Party Politics. Twin Oaks right up there. Withy Bank, solid as a rock on the near side. Number nine is a ditch now. Kildimo with the advantage as they come to this ditch. Kildimo from Party Politics and Twin Oaks on the near side. As they begin to swing left-handed. Kildimo, Twin Oaks going the shortest way on the inside. Party Politics is second on the outer. Twin Oaks is third as they round this turn. On the twist comes next, followed by Withy Banker behind. Willie Bank is solid as a rock. And then Cool Ground and then Wilsford. David Stukey making a little bit of ground from the rear now. The back marker is Boreen Owen as they swing into the straight on this circuit. And as they jump into Twin Oaks right up there almost with uh, Kildimo now. Kildimo, Twin Oaks, party politics towards the stand side. Another plain one, number 11. Party politics and Kildimo from Twin Oaks, cool ground, on the twist. Just behind them, Withy Bank, solid as a rock over on the far side. David's Dukey getting quite close to them, young Ken Hartnett. Kildimo and party politics from Twin Oaks as they come down to the next ditch, the penultimate ditch, number 13 of the 22 fences in all and Kildimo bowling along in the lead from Party Politics and Twin Oaks and Cool Ground. Solid as a rock and roll. Davis Dukey's gone there. Davis Dukey has gone at that ditch. Bori Owens only just jumped it. And Kildimo bowls along in the lead over the water from Party Politics and Twin Oaks and on the twist and Solid as a rock on the inside and then Cool Ground, then Withy Bank and finally Wilsford. And Wilsford got a lot to do. The horse who looked as though he would have won in 1990 if he hadn't fallen at the last. Boreen Owen is a long way behind the remainder. Hard to see him possibly figuring now as Kildimo still bowls along in the lead. But Twin Oaks has moved into second on the inside with Party Politics next, then on the twist. Then comes Cool Ground and Solid as a Rock and Withy Bank and Wilsford getting a little bit closer. Kildimo. Boreen Owen has been pulled up and Kildimo the leader. 
from Twin Oaks, unbeaten on this course in six previous Haydock appearances. And once again, Twin Oaks doesn't jump that all that well. He's just a little bit deliberate this afternoon. Kildimo still the leader. Twin Oaks being pushed up there now by Neil Doughty to almost join him. Solid as a rock has gone third. Party politics comes next, and behind party politics is cool ground. And then Withy Bank and on the twist, and then Wilsford, who's got a lot to do. Over this one, Kildimo and Twin Oaks, these two from party politics. Cool ground and solid as a rock, and on the twist, Withy Bank and Wilsford. Almost together, the leaders there. Kildimo and Twin Oaks as they come to the final ditch now. Twin Oaks on the inside of Kildimo. This is the last of the ditches now. Twin Oaks landed just in the lead from Kildimo. Then in third is Cool Ground. Four solid as a rock. Five is Party Politics. Six is Wilford. Seven and eight are on the twist and Withy Bank. The racing now awards the home turn in the 1992 Greenall's Gold Cup and Kildimo going up again on the outside of Twin Oaks. Kildimo will not be denied this afternoon. Then in third comes Cool Ground, four is Party Politics as they come down towards the next. Twin Oaks defending his unbeaten record here with Kildimo still upsizing Cool Ground in third. Party Politics four under pressure is solid as a rock. Wilsford trying to get on terms with them, but looks a hopeless prospect at the moment. They're coming down towards the second last fence now, and it's Kildimo on the near side. Twin Oaks over on the far side. Kildimo lands just in the lead from Twin Oaks. Cool Ground is third. Party Politics four. Wilsford five. A faller there is Withy Bank. They're coming down to the final fence now, and here's a resurrected Kildimo coming down to it with a length advantage over. Twin Oaks over on the far side. Kildimo's going to land in the lead. Kildimo from Twin Oaks only about a length in it. Cool Ground is finishing well in third party politics. Four. Kildimo is the leader now. And here comes Cool Ground to challenge Twin Oaks for second place. As Kildimo now is running out of steam as they race up towards the line. And Cool Ground is putting in a tremendous run over on the far side. He looks as though he's got him. Cool Ground has got him as he races up towards the line. Cool Ground from Kildimo as they race up towards the line. And Cool won the Green Alls Gold Cup with second kill Dymo, third was Twin Oaks and four the running on Wills for the marvellous national trial on the near side then party politics, solid as a rock almost pulled up and so the result of the 1992 Green Alls Gold Cup is first, number two cool ground, owned by Whitcomb Manor Racing Stables Limited trained by Toby Balding and written by Adrian Maguire, second was number five, kill Dymo, owned by Lady Harris, trained by Mrs. Sue Smith and written by Richard Guest. And third was number one, Twin Oaks, owned by Mr. J and G. Morton, trained by Gordon Richards and written by Neil Doughty. And fourth was the running on, number six, Wilsford, an immediate uh, reaction from uh, the bookmakers. Ladbrokes goes 16.